It is now definite. Korea's rival parties will miss Friday's deadline to reach an agreement on redrawing the country's electoral districts ahead of general elections in April. But they did agree on one thing. They'll try to negotiate the terms with one another for another month. Arirang's parliamentary correspondent, Ji Myung-gil, has more. The ruling's Henry party is against increasing the number of seats in the National Assembly from the current 300. Instead, it wants to increase the number of constituencies and reduce the number of proportional representatives who are chosen based on the total number of votes each party gets. The party believes this will make room for more rural constituencies. The Senuri Party is doing all it can to prevent the loss of seats in rural regions by lowering the number of proportional representatives. But the opposition bloc is only thinking about trying to keep the current number of proportional representatives the same. There are currently 54 lawmakers elected through the proportional representation system, and the main opposition New Politics Alliance for Democracy Party wants to maintain that number. It believes that doing otherwise would stoke regionalism in Korean politics. Our basic policy is to maintain the current number of proportional representatives and prevent the expansion of assembly seats. We'll also do our best to prevent the loss of seats for rural areas. Last year, the Constitutional Court ruled that electoral boundaries should be readjusted to address the problem of unequal representation, which has arisen because of changes to the population. Under the plan currently up for consideration, the number of urban electoral districts would increase while the number of rural constituencies would decrease in accordance with the shrinking of rural populations. The two parties hope to reach agreement on a rezoning scheme before the current parliamentary session ends in December. Amid the deadlock, lawmakers did pass some 40 pending livelihood bills on Thursday. They also agreed to extend the life of the Special Parliamentary Political Reform Committee by a month to continue their discussions on readjusting the electoral map. Chim Young-gil, Arirang News.